Hi guys, I'm Daz the Double Glazer. Uh, I hope you watched the last video. So there's no need for any more awkward introductions. Uh, so on this video, like I did on the last one, I sort of went back in time and showed you some old footage of what we got up to at that particular time. I'm gonna do the same in this video. I'm gonna take us back to October 2021. Yeah, October. Uh, we did a hairdresser shop front. Uh, so I'm just gonna show you that because I'll be honest with you, I haven't been filming for the past few weeks. So I've got quite a lot of footage that I, obviously this is the second video. So I've got quite a lot of footage that I'm sat on. Uh, so we're gonna get that onto YouTube and I uh, hope you enjoy and I'll see you in video three. How you pe some of you people do it daily is beyond me. Anyway, enjoy. See you in the next one. <coughs> so it's Wednesday. <coughs> it's 20 past seven. I've just got to site. Um, I'm on site all day today. Not in the office at all, which makes a change. Um, we have got a hairdresser's shop front to uh, rip out and install today. Not looking forward to it. The glass that we've got to take out is absolutely huge. Um, but yeah, I'll take you inside and show you what we've got to do. So yeah, this is what we've got to do. As you can see, I've boarded it up. <coughs> I boarded it up about 12 weeks ago. That's how long it's taken to get the shop front to us. And normally you probably get it in about four to six weeks, but due to material shortages at the moment, it's taken a bit longer. Now, I feel like death today. Um, well, I don't feel too bad. I've just got, I'm, that's been a bit dramatic. I've just got a raging headache for the last three days. But this shop is my mum and stepdad's shop. So I can't really let them down. So here I am. Plus I've already got a skip on hire just for one day as well. Normally I wouldn't hire a skip. Um, I'd normally take whatever we've got in the van and at our skip back at the uh, back at the unit, but uh, it just makes life easier to be honest. So what I'm going to do before the skip gets here is take all this boarding down, and then Matty's going to come and meet me here, probably in about half an hour, and we'll get cracking. Now, all I've got to do is wait for the skip to arrive and Matty. Oh, wrong light switch. And also make a cup of tea.
look at the size of that glass. Very heavy as well. to quickly knit back to the unit there is a tool that I use for I'll show you when we get back to side well I'll show you on this door here is where the door is fixed um, this is a side hung door the doors we use tend to use now are end loaded so um, what happens is when you take you have to take the door sash off to get some fixings in in your frame so once the door comes off, your door closer will gently close back on itself. So it's in the closed position, but without the door on. So what we have to do is we have to crank it back into its open position. Let me try and think this is right. Yep. Yeah. Crank it back into its open position, put the door on open, and then, yeah, that's the, and then we put the screws in and then it holds. Whereas um, if you just put the door back on without moving the door closer, the door would just stay open. So when you went to close it, it would open again. Because um, the door we've got on this particular job, it's called a non-hold open. So when you open the door, it shuts gently on itself. So like I say, if you were to put the door back on, as it is now, the door would just stay open. So I've come back, the lights are on now. So I've come back to get uh, a tool I use to just crank it. After all that, I think it's actually downstairs. <clears throat> so I've just nipped home as I've ordered some glass suckers from Amazon and they're supposed to be here by now. They're not. So the installation's going quite well to be fair. Um, I wouldn't say I was worried about it, but I certainly wasn't looking forward to it and neither was Matty. Um, but yeah. He's just having his dinner. I've just quickly nipped home because we're only working around the corner from my house. And um, I'm hoping that Amazon will be here soon. I mean, we can do it without, um, but it'll certainly be a lot easier with glass suckers. So, yeah, I'm going to nip back to site and then hopefully we'll attempt putting the glass in without the glass suckers. Should be fine. I mean, there's three massive units. Um, I say massive, they're not massive, they're, they're big. But they're about 100 kilos each, I think 98 kilos, which is heavy. And then we've got to turn it from its side up on its, turn it all over. So yeah, the glass suckers would have been a bit of a help. And then we've got to shuffle it. It's called shuffle glazed, the shop line um, system is. So yeah, I'm going to head back there now and then hopefully the glass suckers will come and they will leave them with a neighbour. So yeah, and I haven't filmed much of the installation because there's quite a lot going on and I didn't have time to set up the camera. So yeah, let's go back to the site, see how we're getting on. So, half past five, and that job is all done. Um, yeah, complete. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be, but like I say, I think I built it up in my head that it was going to be quite awkward. Um, but yeah, 
all in all not a bad day uh, what time are we on yeah half five quarter to six been here since quarter past seven so yeah I thought I'd be here a bit later to be honest but yeah it's actually gone quite well which I'm very surprised at um, a few little issues mainly just with the glass really um, but that's quite common at the moment um, one of the glass units has got a about a meter long mark on the inside of the unit so unfortunately we've got to change that um, as it's on the inside it's a supplier issue so but it doesn't help the fact that I've got to come and change it so and we don't get compensated for that which is very annoying but yeah on to tomorrow or Thursday yeah so yeah all in all a good day See you tomorrow. Wait, we're not finished yet. I just want to say thanks for watching if you've stuck, uh, stuck to it so far. Um, I get that they're not the best produced videos. Um, again, these are my first couple of, of attempts. They will get better over time. Um, like anything, um, you know, if you stick to it, you will get better. So, yeah, hit that subscribe if you want to follow along. Like I say, I'm going to try and do these weekly on a Sunday at around 6pm. So, if I don't, I want you to be in the comments. Daz, where's this week's video? I'm not happy. So yeah, um, <clears throat> that's that for that video. And I'm going to try a little, try a little outro. Um... And here it is. So, whatever time you're watching this video. Good afternoon, good evening, and good night. <laughs>